Hello internet, so yeah, um, just a quick video here. Basically, with my warlock, I finished the quest line of the uh, crucible quest where it sends you to everybody in the, in the tower. Um, right now I'm on the step with my hunter and titan, and it gives you the weekly um, crucible bounties that give you like a nightfall, nightfall tier rewards. I have a share button of it real quick, let me show it. But basically, um, the last quest on it is going to be this one right here, the mountaintop, and it asks you to earn 9 points, Crucible wins are worth 3, uh, starting a new match cost 1, that's the final one. And then the ones leading up to that one, and, and you get a reward, it's a heavy rocket launcher, I'll show it in the, later in the video. Uh, and then uh, basically once you get that, you get these quests from Shax that he has personally for you. And then uh, one of them says that if you get five of them done in the week, you get an unknown reward. So it's, it's it's supposedly Nightfall tier. I got a legendary weapon. I'll show it with my Warlock as well. But I'm not sure like if you can get exotics or not. Anyway, it's cool because um, you only have to do it once per character. I'm sorry, once per account. And it carries over to your other characters. Because my Titan and my Hunter are both on this... Um, this part right here where you have to get you know six plus auto rifle kills and so or wins with six auto rifle kills do that three times and then it it, make, it has um it goes auto rifle pulse rifle scout rifle hand cannon and i think after that it does the final mission the final quest where you have to get the nine points there might be one after that i forgot i'll make an update video next week because i i didn't like you know do one for each of these but it's a long quest line it takes a long time but then once you finish it you know, it's it's per account. So I completely forgot about this before I went to bed this bed this morning. So I, <laughs> I or I would have did this with all my characters, but now I have it with, with everybody and not just like the hunt with the warlock. It's a pretty long quest line, so I'm glad about that. And it's cool because this is complete all five you know weekly bounties in in one week, and you get a reward. But it's Monday, so it's the day before reset. Like, how am I going to do that when this th there's one on here that says uh, you know. Daily playlist reward, play the Crucible Daily on three different days, three times. I can't do that before Tuesday because it's Monday. So it's cool actually because you pick it up, it's a 0 to 5 right now. But then when I go to it in my menu, it, uh, it already has three completed because I believe the Nightfall Weekly, I'm not sorry, not, not the Nightfall, the Iron Banner Weekly quests count. And so on my Hunter and my Titan, I have three or five already. And I can just pick up, uh, well, this one's pretty easy. Win one in Control, Clash, and Rift. And then, uh, let's see, I think Individual Achievement is the other one I got done with my Warlock. So there's that one. Those are probably like the two easiest ones. And there's also, uh, but yeah, win seven. And this points one pretty easy if you just get, if you just win as well. But yeah, I've got so basically I've got that picked up on my my hunter and titan. I would show my hunter, but I don't want to waste time in the video. So yeah, so they're both three fifths of the way, and I gotta get two more, and I'll get a you know legendary slash nightfall tier reward. And then um on my warlock, what I got, I'll show in this video too. My <laughs> my arm my um my inventory was full because I was carrying a bunch of stuff on me, so my rewards went to my postmaster. But you get modes of light, strange coins. I forget how many, and then what I got this week on my Warlock was this legendary weapon I'm going to show. And then also when you finish that that quest, I just realized I have it shared in the in the share button thing, so let me go back to that. But once you finish that quest, you get a, um, a legendary rocket launcher. This, uh, the Hothead at 150, and these are the stats on it. Or not the stats, I'm sorry, the perks. Increased reload speed when it's empty, and then uh, faster reloading and better handling when you're the last living person on your fire team. So it drops at 150, but it's legendary. And since it's a year two weapon, you can infuse it. So I've infused it up to, so far I've got it to 269, har har. And I'll, I'll go ahead and keep it, because you know, <laughs> I'm not going to make the same mistake twice where it's like, oh, it's just a rocket launcher, because you know, maybe it's awesome. I haven't used it, so. 
eh, and I'm not a fan of rocket launchers, but that being said, it's like, I'll go ahead and give it just because. So yeah, um, and then I'm like, I'm making progress on my other quests, but I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm wondering like if I hold these, oh, this is a, this is a daily, not a weekly, but yeah, you can see they also look different on the icon, whereas this is just a crucible one, this has a little circle, and the, um, well, it looks different from these, <laughs> the daily ones. Uh, but yeah, the, the reward I got this week with my warlock, I was gonna show this in the weekly video, but it's like, I'm just gonna make this video for good to work, that way I can come back and do this crucible thing, make the weekly video, uh, Destiny Talk for the week video, and that'll be that. And that's, that's my goal now with, like, Destiny Talk, is just do them on Mondays. And then, you know, whatever I've done, I've done. Yeah. If I don't have anything done, then I'll just talk about it next week, it's whatever. And then if I don't do one, I don't do one, it's whatever, so yeah. Oh, also, I've been streaming a ton, because I, I just played the crap, I, I played the crap out of Destiny this week, like, Iron Banner, I was super pumped for Trials, and then it got delayed, because that stupid Night Stalker glitch, so basically, instead of, uh, playing any trials at all I did strikes all day on Saturday like I like 12 hours straight it's, it's in the stream but it's weird because it like cut off at the end so it didn't show like me getting my final set of packages because like every four hours I would turn them in when I went back or I would turn in my, my ingrams when I went back to the uh, tower but whatever I don't think I'm ever gonna do that again that was that was a lot of grinding it was it was cool because I got like so much stuff because I was using strain I was using three coins every strike so I did get a decent amount of exotics but I think from that I've learned, I'm just gonna get Ingrams from Zer. It's just, it's just easier. <laughs> it's just easier on me, man. But this is the gun I got. It's the Red Spectre. It's basically like the legendary Red Death Gun, where you know they have like the one that's the, uh, there's a Hawk Moon one. Um, I'm not sure if there's others, but basically it's like it's it looks like an exotic, but it's legendary, and it has different stats. Do I have my Red Death on me? I don't know. I do. So I can compare it, and it's no red death. Uh, it's actually got better rate of fire and impact. Worse range and ac stability, more rounds in the magazine. But it doesn't heal you when you kill stuff, or speed up your reload when you kill stuff. Not easier to aim under fire, so... Yeah. I'm going to take this gun, and I'm going to dismantle it and get legendary marks. 280. I have nothing to infuse up from to from less than that, so let's do it. I mean, sure, I could like wait until Wednesday to see if like, oh man, these are probably awesome, but psh, whatever. I'll talk about my weekly video, like why I'm no longer doing that. So yeah. Uh, rodeo speed reload. Okay, painted magazine on this would be pretty good. So, oh, it's an auto rifle. I thought it was a pulse rifle. So look, looking now, I see it's an auto rifle. I'm definitely not keeping it because. I've got plenty of those, and my Warlock doesn't use auto rifles, and my Titan has awesome auto rifles that are better than this one, so. Eh. It, and it has Icarus. Icarus to me is like an instant dismantle perk. Like, if it has Icarus, or the one where you shoot ammo and you get it back, or the one you can collect ammo that's like farther away, those, those three perks, death sentence. And yeah, Red Spectre. Goodbye. So, there's that. But yeah, when I finish the, uh,. The weekly crucible quest chain. I'm 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 sorry, not quest chain. When I get my week weekly crucible bounties done with my hunter and titan, I'll make a video of like showing what I got because um yeah. Cause I, I know I got Mozilla Light and Strange Coins, I just forgot how many. And I wanted to put it on video, but I was like so so um you know excited to like see oh man what I'm gonna get, what I'm gonna get that I I I turned it in. And then I didn't share button it because it didn't go to my, my inventory. It just went to my post method, and I wasn't sure if that was what that or if that came from like a crucible reward or something that I'd been doing. So I was like, whatever, I'll just I'll just go to sleep. And then I woke up and I remembered it's a per account, so I don't have to do it again on my Hunter and Titan that quest. It's just I can just get the weekly um, night or I'm sorry the weekly crucible bounties on them. So I'm gonna do that. Hopefully before the reset when I get home from work, get it done. And report back, make a video, and yeah, that'll be that. So that is it for this video. Nice short update on the uh, weekly crucible quests and what you gotta go through to get them at the very end. And uh, thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe, favorite, share with your friends or not. That's cool too. And until you see or hear from me again, thanks for watching, and I'm now signing off.